What's going on, y'all? What is going on? Thank you for choosing once again to click on the channel. This is Oya Oy. I'm simply here to do my job. Get the messages to the collective. How is everybody? Thank you guys for your continuous support. Thank you for liking, sharing, subscribing, whatever you're doing to support the channel. So, y'all, I was chilling out, right? And I was listening to this conversation. And it wasn't me mailing. It's just uh, someone literally has they, uh phone connected to their uh, stereo system, okay? So, y'all know everything's a message. So, I had got, um, no, they're not getting ready to come and hide out over here and do the same things that they've been doing over there. So, there could be a message for somebody. Someone could literally be trying to go, um, whether they trying to stay in someone's house, stay with family members or something. That could be significant, but we're just going to pull on this energy and see what we got. It feels good outside today, so I'll figure it out. I'll be like, yeah, let's get some air. Um, I actually got to meditate uh, yesterday because I'm like, God, what is it that you need me and want me to do at this time? Because one thing that I want to do is know that, you know, no matter what I'm going through, I'm going to always give praise and continue to rise. So, you guys, if you're going through anything, just know that you can get through it, okay? I'm going uh, to pull some of these other ones so we can get an overall message. But, yeah, it's like somebody was like, they're not coming over here with that bullshit, okay? So, someone could be trying to leave. Someone's trying to move in with someone else. I'm also getting that there are things that's happening fast. Something about uh, the immigrants, or there could be a love relationship coming over. Someone doesn't know that your actual spouse, your spiritual spouse, your soulmate, is going to be of a, a, what I hate saying race, but they are a part of a different background, okay? So you could actually be um, coming uh, into union with someone and you didn't think you would ever come into union with this person i'm also picking something up about uh something that could be coming to an interracial relationship coming fast okay so let me see what this is yeah watch being in these certain relationships with certain people that you know now you may be out in the cold if an energy shift happens and you like this person went from loving me um it, but really it was lust okay a lot of different things are being revealed maybe you felt like it was love maybe it was lust heavy on a spiritual um uh, it could have been a spiritual connection but there's literally somebody that is uh okay so that's what it is i had to pause for a second um, whoever this is, there was somebody that was, uh, if they wasn't using this person or manipulating them for money or a place to stay, there's someone that is in an interracial relationship. Now this person is going to come back because someone is being put out in the cold. Okay. So someone could literally been finding out, Hey, you was with me for literally my bloodline, my spiritual inheritance, my money, or they could be finding out that somebody that somebody is, uh, with does not like that particular lineage okay this was a spiritual spouse or this was a karmic spiritual spouse that came in um in order to manipulate something somebody needs to connect to like their native ancestors or their ancestors i feel like someone is really missing out on either connecting to their higher self or their fullest potential because of who they with uh yeah this this is a love situation i feel like there was cupid stupid involved in this somebody got hit with an arrow it could have been this person's looks this could have been this person's finances but uh somebody has somebody mentally entrapped and i'm getting that uh someone uses or um if they're not using this person's hair they are manipulating with sex they also doing fire magic. This person, somebody took somebody's dreads or did something with somebody's dreads. So, so someone could have locks, okay? I don't like seeing dreads, but so I, somebody has locks. Um, and someone took some of their locks and did something with it. I'm talking about pay, opening up pages, uh, what whatever they're doing. Yeah, they didn't broke. Somebody's finding out that they they spouse is not who, who they supposed to be spiritually. This person took a gamble on being with this person. Yeah, they were still having someone else in the background. Uh, this could be, I ain't even gonna front. This is a white chick that came up with the use of uh, a man here simply because whatever, whoever this man is, is black, uh, Native American, 
or Indian or Cuban or something. And this person felt like this person was going to bring them to some type of stardom, but they've been getting some money from this person to like work with someone. So this could actually be, um, a cancer, a fire sign, a water sign. Okay. Heavy on somebody that was manipulating a relationship that is inter in an interracial relationship. I feel like whoever this was, was financially supporting someone, all their money, uh, putting all their eggs in one basket. And this is one of those tricks. Hey girl, we're going to go out tonight. Um, and they go and do what they want to do with whoever this is that comes in with some good sex. And now this person, you know, may get caught or found out about it. now all of a sudden you know this person wants to divorce you take all your shit okay so y'all be mindful of it you certain masculine energies that are into your bag you have uh, spiritually aligned with who you are your purpose your mission okay because there are some females out here um and, and they could be either any background um that are coming in uh just for money or manipulating so let's see yeah somebody's into a lot of shit like i'm talking about they know what they're doing there's a female group here too that's also if they're not actually tra uh trafficking um why did this come out if they're not actually trafficking with this man they're getting caught up it's like this man's getting caught up so there's a female this female group here that's been working uh for some money selling off each other or selling off some uh chicks that they recruiting there's a man that they actually gonna throw under the bus but like get all these bitches like what mm -hmm. they get right though this man under the bus because they already kept a lot of people up in the cold or up at night. Okay, so let's see. Let's see what else we got. <sighs> mm -hmm. Somebody's uh, heavily involved in insurance fraud. So someone is going fishing. Okay, whoever this is likes to go fishing on the internet. Uh, maybe looking for a certain type of female or a certain type of male. So they can literally marry this person for insurance fraud. Somebody that's also um, in a controlled bar environment. Okay, so I'm getting that uh, I'm Not Gonna Cry by Mary J. Blige. And then I heard she was a friend of mine. Okay, so someone's finding out that somebody has a, a child by their spouse now or an ex-spouse. And then you got no more drama. Someone's dealing with like a, a domestic violence relationship. So something about somebody was led to do this or this person did this because of some insurance fraud didn't come through or something like that. So that's cool. I hate pulling on these reads, but it's like, can we get something good? Can we get something good? You got Georgia, Florida, Tennessee, North Carolina, South Carolina, Alabama, Florida. Marvelous meditation. Start meditating. Stop letting people pick at you, okay? It's time for you to bloom. It's just like you are above something already, uh, and you've been having headaches, but I feel like the only reason why you've been having headaches is because you either up online all the time, constantly looking for a mate, or someone's up all night constantly looking, um, scouting for certain energies, either viewing their profiles, Something about somebody's also booking flights. I'm not getting A and E, A and M. What's that? First 48. Got my Migo on the phone. Something about somebody hit somebody up to pull a first 48. Oh my goodness. Whatever weapon. Somebody's also doing like a background check. Oh, somebody's like lurking, lurking online, y'all. Whoever this is is constantly looking up online, uh, doing background checks, uh, trying to find out what somebody works. Trying to figure out what weapon they can use, how they can harm somebody. This person could uh, actually be addicted to pills. Yeah. So you got it. Somebody is also kicking the addiction. You could also be kicking the addiction of a being addicted to pills. Um, you know that when you grow consciously, you know that, you know, whatever you're placing into your body is just simply, um, you know, disconnecting you from your soul. Something about somebody, whoever you are, you're very smart. Somebody's a, a, a disciple already spiritually. OK, you meant to do some type of work and it's like somebody has been searching for you everywhere. I don't know if you used to do drugs with this person or this person wants you to do drugs, but somebody's searching for somebody everywhere um, because they know that they at the finish line of something. It's like you at the finish line. So you get ready to inherit your spiritual journey or inherit your spiritual wholeness. OK, also having something in your possession. So someone's getting ready to have something in their possession. I feel like this could also be you connecting to your homeland or your ancestral homeland. Maybe the, uh, the South has been where you've uh, 
resided a certain part of the south maybe you go into a different part or you going more north something about you actually connecting to your ancestral homeland so let's see yeah and being mindful of what you putting on your body certain clothing jewelry certain things like that yeah because people are glitching and malfunctioning y'all remember on this channel a long time ago i said that people just gonna start like twitching this shit people ain't gonna know how to say stuff they neck i'm getting that robot you know what i'm saying you're gonna start seeing these energies for who they are but it's like you already above it um so it, this could be funny to you but it's not funny to a lot of other people that don't know what they dealing with um because it's a scary situation when you wake wake up and you like, uh, what's really going on around me? Yeah, so I'm out here. Somebody literally just pulled up playing Jay-Z. Something about where the butlers be. Okay, something about where the butlers be. It's no coincidence why something is happening. Why you seeing certain energies in your sleep. Okay, something about uh, skins. Skins and sins. Somebody could be doing like illegal hunting. Okay, so let's pick back up on this energy. What we got going on? Evil eye removal. Something about some treatment, okay? Learning how to use your pain right now for uh, something constructive. Transmuting that energy that gets sent to you because I'm telling you to get sent, okay? So let's see. I was getting that too. Somebody's, uh, I'm telling you, these electronics are acting funny, okay? Something about your electronics. Um, and there's being a glitch and malfunctioning. And somebody that could have been hacking devices. Uh, so you got hiding behind AI. Kiss, kiss my ass. Someone is literally using a profile, okay? They profile pictures fake. Or they have doctored some pictures anyway, okay? I kept getting that energy again. Somebody is fishing online. Not only do they want you to reveal some information, they want to, like, will your ass in um, because they need new energy. Somebody needs a new supply. These are narcissistic energies that refuse to give in or give up. So they look for people that have um, either felt like, you know, this is the one or this is time I'm going to meet mine. Be mindful of these energies right now, okay? Somebody is hiding behind AI or doctored pictures on their profile um this person sounds good they're gonna tell you everything that you want to hear need to hear you, you know what i'm saying whether you're creaming in your drawers or not it does not matter ladies fellas please watch some of these setup energies that are out right now i'm getting somebody could even be uh getting if somebody somebody has like a tow truck driving company somebody's being either followed or somebody's getting their car towed okay somebody this could be who's following somebody imagine somebody you know what i'm saying you thinking you're being followed or stalked or something no when you balance that shit out you know that this is a consequence of something that you did you can't have that car towed okay so yeah somebody somebody could have stolen something or a package so you got will and flesh fix your weakened mind so fix your week in mind. Let me see. Call back all the pieces you chipped off to give away, okay? So now's the time for you to call back your energy. Say your prayers. Do your cord cutting. Believe in what it is that you want because someone simply just want to be around someone um, for a, a come up, okay? You being told to call your energy back from an ex. Call your energy back because you will feel better soon it was all a part of your soul's ascension everything every piece of pain you felt was for your soul ascension you needed to have it revealed to you that there are people that are willing to have wicked blessings they're going to do whatever they can um in order to receive something but they're doing it the way that it's not meant to be done people are being tricked into see and deceived into believing that you can actually hurt and harm someone and have a successful life Okay, so you got a mother involved in your destruction of your Ten of Cups. Okay, so there could be a mother that's actually involved. Someone doesn't want uh, a mother here doesn't want you to either meet an actual soulmate or something. So this could be one of those set up energies. There could be somebody that's behind an actual profile. Imagine if you find out you've been talking to your mother the whole time. I don't know why I'm getting it. people really be on this shit. Yeah, some about something loading on a a, a computer. Okay, so you got, uh, let's see, what else is this? Yeah, you're not going to meet somebody uh, right now if your mother's in the background, okay? Because your mother's still worried about, somebody's mother's still worried about uh, 
having trouble with a case that they teamed up with either a judge, a lawyer, investigator, or a prosecutor. Okay, so someone could have literally teamed up with an investigator, uh, investigator, a prosecutor, a judge, or a lawyer, um, and because of a case, they having problems. But this is karmic mother energy okay this this energy only wants to receive something because maybe they felt like you was going to be the external sacrifice this person felt like they didn't have to heal something they experienced they also felt like that it was easier for them to you know offer your ass up instead of doing the work that they needed to to receive the actual blessings from god some of these people don't believe in the most high they don't believe in tapping to their highest potential or they feel like this could be the get back for you know oh i, I had your ass i'll take your ass out Okay, so somebody is um, dealing with something simply because what a mother did. Okay, so you got, get your house in order. It's time to pray. Somebody is a crazy karmic. Um, and if you're, if your flesh is willing right now, then that means your mind is weak. Because someone wants to play on your emotions and they want to do it by connecting to you or connecting to your flesh. Somebody is.